Hey guys, um, today I'm unboxing a standard Candy Chaos box. Now, I don't think I've ever had this size box. I think I've normally got the small one or the light one, but um, they had an offer on and I think I paid about, I think it was 15 pounds, but this should be about 20 pounds, so I decided to go for it. Um, there's a box inside a box, so bear with me a minute. Okay, so I have one of these um, mystery airhead efforts. Um, that's not even in the box, that's just an extra they've thrown in. Oh, and they've also thrown in a can of strawberry soda. So I'll give that a try. I don't know that I've ever had strawberry soda. Okay, so this is the main box. I think I can hear nerds in there. <laughs> Let's see what we have. Okay. Okay, now I don't I don't know if this is much bigger than this than the um uh the small size, so I'm gonna have to like figure it out at the end. Okay, so we have some goldfish baked snack crackers, which I've not tried before. I hear people talk about goldfish on American TV programmes all the time, but I've never actually tried them, so give that a whirl. Okay, oh we have one of my favourites. They are delicious. I love those. Uh, we've also got um, a couple of s'mores pop tarts, which I think I tried years ago, but I don't think I've had them recently. I don't think so. Anyway, definitely wasn't part of my pop tart challenge. Um, okay, I also have a gardenia, gardena. I don't know how you say it. I presume the first one, uh, hazelnut wafer, which I've not tried before. Um, I kind of assume because I've had so many of these boxes now that I would have tried everything they have on the in their like stock repertoire. Um, but it turns out there are some other things. Okay, let's see what else there is. Um, we've got some old-fashioned shortbread cookies. Okay, there's one big box or something, so let's get that out. Okay, um, we've got some Hostess cupcakes, uh, which is a huge box of them. Um, I don't, I mean, I've not tried them, so they might be delicious and it might be the best thing ever, but I feel like having a box this big um, inside, ooh, inside a box, like, it's taken up a huge portion of the box is what I'm trying to say. Um, so if I don't like them, that's going to be really disappointing. Um, I feel like maybe they normally have more variation because they don't have big boxes in there. So, I mean, there's not... In fact, actually, this is, if I'm honest, this is quite disappointing. Um, because there's not too much left in here. Um, okay, so there's Smarties and Cream. Smarty side and creamy side. I've not, I've not heard of those before. So, I mean, that's quite interesting. Um, and there is some sensational chewy fruit candy, high chew, and it is grape flavour, so that helps too. But then the only other things in this whole box are about a billion packets of nerds which aren't that exciting because I've had them loads of times from them. Bollocks. Um, it's not that exciting because I've had them loads of times and even if I hadn't had them, I don't think I need as many packets as they've given me. I mean, just hold on. Ugh, it's just nuts. They've sent me one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine packets of lemonade, wild cherry nerds. Right, and then, one, two, three, five packets of these strawberry nerds. Like, I, I don't really get that. I was really looking forward to this box. And there are a couple of things in here that will be great, but I just don't understand why they've chucked so many of these things in rather than giving me a bit more variation. Um, it's a bit strange. I might actually message them and say that I'm not that impressed and see what they say because um, I might only have paid £15 for the box but why not, I mean it's worth, well they sell it for £20 so you'd expect to get £20 worth of stuff 
and I might have 20 pounds of the stuff. I mean, I don't know how much all this stuff costs in America and I know they've got to pay shipping costs, but normally there's just a lot more variation. I don't know if that's just me being expecting too much of them. I don't, I don't really know. It's a bit strange. Um, so yeah, not sure really what's, what to think. Do you, do you think this is a good box? I mean, I, I don't know. Uh, jewelry is out really. I think there are some good things in here, but I don't know if they've done as good a job as they usually do. So, I'm not sure. Let me know what you think in the comments. Um, I will leave a link to the Facebook group that I use for my discount codes from this company. Um, in case you fancy giving it a go and seeing what you think of their boxes. Uh, but I think today, I think I am going to be, gonna, I think my overall feeling is I'm a bit disappointed with this box. So, hmm, not sure. I'm not sure about that one, Candy Chaos, I'm afraid. Hi guys, so it's been about five minutes since I recorded my video. Um, I took a picture of the box and sent it to um, Candy Chaos and said, Look, I'm not really that happy, like, you've put this huge box of things which I might not even like, and then there's like 14 packets of nerds and I'm a bit disappointed. And within five minutes they've apologised and sent me half the money back um, as an apology. Also, they didn't have to, get, have to do that. They could have just said, well, it's a mystery box. You know, uh, it is what it is. But yeah, I think that they appreciated the fact that normally I'm really thrilled with my boxes and make these videos. And that, you know, if I think there's something not quite right with this box and I wasn't too impressed with it, that they would obviously like to, to make that up to me as a customer. So I'm really impressed with that. Um, I've said that with the money they sent me back I might well order a light box later in the week so that I can get some of the candy I was perhaps I feel like I'm missing from this box um, so I mean they've they've come up front again even when I have been disappointed they their customer service is spot on um, I wanted to, be able to say good things about the company all the time because I really like them so I'm quite happy that they've managed to turn this order around and been a very happy person. So thank you very much Candy Chaos um, for being so good at what you do. And uh, yeah, that's all for now. Take care and I'll see you all soon. Bye!